Hello, welcome back. This is Kenshin1913, and we are let's playing. Breath. Shoot, I, almost, I was about to say Breath of Fire, people. This is crazy. Anyways, we're playing, let's playing Dragon Quest Monsters Caravan Heart. In the last episode, we met the we met the um, the illusion of Moonbrook. Now we are in the Tower of Wind because she wants three beautiful things. How about you get out of the way so that I can go find out the? As you remember, we need uh, we need to find some people. And here's the bark that we met in uh, in Hamlet. And isn't that awesome? They're playing the Dragon Quest II tower theme. Whoa! This is this bar just put those people to sleep. Putting someone to sleep and thing. I didn't know bards could do that. I mean, the only actual bard that I know of is is Edward in uh, Final Fantasy IV, and he was awful. And we get the magic wata, which restores your MP. Twenty to thirty. Which is pretty good. So let's keep exploring said tower. Oh no, the effect of holy water. Yeah, this tower was confusing. Oh, we got ourselves a new enemy, Mad Condor. Very nicely destroyed by Anne, our martial artist. Slash fighter, whatever you want to call her. Anyways, yeah, this tower was confusing even when I was here, but I think we had to go to the sides. If I remember correctly, but let's see if we can find ourselves treasure. Alright, those are the stairs from downstairs. Goody, goody. Alright, over here, anything? Oh, we got some new enemies. Wicked axes. Their axes that are alive. And they're ready to chop down our faces. But we won't let them because we are super powerful at the moment. And we are kicking ass and taking names because that's what we do here. We kick ass and take names. Alright, so. No treasure, huh? Come on, treasure, where are you? Oh, we got another new enemy, a Wyvern. What the frig is going on? Hold on a second. Huh, I don't know what the hell is going on. I'm sorry, people. Sometimes my computer just likes to hiccup. And be stupid. If it continues, I will stop the episode and figure out what the hell is going on. Yeah, give me a minute. All right, we're back. I need to restart the. I had to restart the program and the friggin' emulator and the and just the computer in general because it was just being a pain in the ass. All right. Nothing. Yeah, I don't know why it was being a pain. Alright, nothing here either. Jeez, this tower sucks. Yeah, if I remember correctly, this tower was a pain in the ass. It was a huge P in the A even back then. I mean, look at it. Whoever designed it should be beaten. Severely, as we fight new enemies, Phantom Glass. Look at these things, they're like... They're like glass, stained glass windows that are, they're like evil. Yeah, and since Carol's a firebird, he doesn't actually get hurt too much by fire. This which is pretty cool. Fire damage, yay. Alright, let's keep going on. Hurry, Keeper! Alright, we got four sets of stairs, and I believe all four... If I'm not mistaken, lead to dead ends. And we just travel up the wrong way. Because that's how I play. 
Although I know that 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 was the wrong way. I'm just double checking. Yep. All these towers have the same uh, structure, so yeah, let's just go back down. I'm not even going to check that last one because I know it's wrong. Wrong, wrong, wrong. So yeah, how, how are you people enjoying the music in this game? I really enjoy the fact that this game takes a character from Dragon Quest 7 and then makes it in the world of Dragon Quest 2, which I think is really cool. But yeah, you gotta watch out for your rations here. Yeah, is it the merchant? Yeah, we're on the first floor. So what we want to do... Oh no, maybe we're not. Anyways, what we want to do is come over here and come outside over here. Now we're actually going to head on the right way. Alright, let's keep going. You know what's funny is I got all ladies in my group, huh? Lady merchant, lady fighter, and a lady warrior. Lady. Ah, screw it, I'll show this battle. It's not a mad condor. I just keep running into singular guys. It's like, what the hell? These singular fellows, they know they, they're no match. They can't beat three monsters. And we find a King Slime Heart. Awesome. I can't wait to turn probably Salen into a healer and a King Slime and see what, like, look at that. Heal us. Well, maybe I should. Huh. I don't know, we'll see. But I need someone to learn Heal Us, damn it. That or the Hustle Dance, which is like... That or Heal Us or the Hustle Dance, which is like Heal Us, but, uh... But, um... What is it? It's like the Heal Us spell, but you can only use it in battle. They do a dance, and then they, you gain, gain back HP. I don't know if I want to come this way yet. Anyways, let's keep going up here. Do -do -do -do. I bet you the first way was the right way. I bet ya. The first way was probably the correct way, but actually we want to hit the top of the tower if I remember correctly. It's better to hit the top of the tower first. Because there's... Look, there's a warrior and a priest here. What's happened to the wind cape? Wasn't it supposed to be here? We'd be able to jump across the dragon's horns. Yeah, just like in Dragon Quest 2. But the wind will always be there for you. The wind is calling all of you. As we hold each other's hands. It's a nice song, mainly because of your beautiful voice. Yes, a traveling bard, you're a real man. Women can become warriors? Oh, that was rude of me. Listen, women can be warriors. Yeah, they make fine warriors. Yeah, you people, what's your deal? And we need to return to Lupagana, which I believe is, um... Let's see, Hamlin, Moonbrook... The name of uh, of the town. Damn it. Yeah, I enjoy traveling with a lot of people. That's right. Take us with you. I'm Seska, the warrior, and this is Tasha, the nun. Nice to meet you. Should we be going now? Yeah, let's take you two. We could always use more people. that town. Lannyport. Lannisport. Yes. Yes, I remember. I am a smart boy. Alright, now we... If we, I wonder what would happen if you put in a group. She's a female cleric. She will heal up your group. I wonder what would happen if... You, and he's... And he, you know what? Sorry, buddy. He's too... She's one less than that, and then she's weighs less than him. Eventually, I'm going to try putting a group... Right now, I'm just going to leave it as is. But eventually, I'm going to try putting a group in that is, like, all of one thing. Yeah, I want to talk to you. I'm on a quest for beautiful things. And 
supposedly you're very handsome. So yeah, maybe you interest the illusion. Things that love like a man that man shares with a woman. Is it okay if I accompany you? Hell yeah. And this guy is called Boldo. So we got ourselves one beautiful thing, maybe? And he is um Bard. New new class, basically what he does is he sings and he can do random effects. He can probably put people to sleep. But I won't know because I hardly ever use a bard. But you know what? If this LP has taught me anything so far, it is experiment. So I will definitely put him. Oh, sweet sassy molassy, I got a wyvern's heart. Nice. Ooh, and you learn heal. You know what? Heal is good for any anybody, even if it's the lowest heal. But anyways, yeah. If I've learned anything in this LP so far, it is experiment. So I will put the bard in my group eventually. And I do want to put... I want to put the three warriors in, and then maybe even if I get three merchants, I'd love to put them in. Alright, so let's go up these sets of stairs, and finish off this place. And you know how Fonz says that you should uh, level up your monsters at 10, like say you want to change your people? Personally, my uh, rule of thumb is I'd like to at least get them to level 15. So that they actually... What the hell? Wasn't there? Shouldn't the Cape of Wind be over here? What the hell? I guess the Cape of Wind is, uh... I don't know. It's gone now. Wasn't there a treasure chest? Like on the second floor or something? Huh. Maybe I got it. I don't even remember. Okay, so let's be crazy and jump off. Yay! Alright, so we got one beautiful thing. Sweet, we gained another level. Awesome. And let's head through this thing. Shortcut. So they were talking about the dragon's horns. Let's uh let's head that way, shall we? For the first thing I wanna do, actually, do I have any wing of wyvern? Oh, son of a bee. Son of a bee, I don't. That's alright. Let's walk back. What I want to do eventually. I think after we go through this test, I'm gonna go and get... Alright, here we are at the thing. Let's talk to the female. Yeah, you're, uh, that's why I'm here. Who else did I join? Who else joined the crew? Nope. Not in here. But yeah, you know what? After a while, only, um... Here, after a while, you can only recruit so many human pe party members or caravan members. Where is everybody? Jeez, are you Dexon? You're Dexon. Where's your Where's your female lady? Is she in the bar. But anyways, you can only you can only recruit so many human party people. Where the hell is the female lady? And the freaking bard. They're not in here. Oh. Not in here either. I did recruit them, didn't I? Are they in the item shop? Yes, here's the female. Oh, interesting. So you can change the names of the guard monsters with talking to this guy. But I don't want to, because I like the names. Names are cool, I like them. Alright, where's the Mont Ration Lady? Did I find another tiny metal? Yes, I did. No, I don't want to trade. Where the hell did the Ration Woman go? What the frig is going on with my caravan? Screw it, we're gonna continue. Can't even find a damn ration lady. Alright, so let's head this way. Oh, we gotta go the other way. Damn you! Curse you, game change. Your game change thing and your, your 
terrain change? What the hell? Hey, dude! You wanna join my group? That would be pretty sweet. Can I go this way? Will you let me go this way? Ah, oh, yes, the desert. Past the desert in the south is the town of Tepa. You should go there. Interesting. Yeah, this is one of the, um, the first chapters that really opens up the world to you. Really. And we got it. Uh oh, we all going on a diet. Kiefer and his crew decided they needed a diet for a while. Rations will be consumed slowly. Very nice. That's always nice when you get one of them. Let's use an apple. We need to eat some apples, even though we're on a diet. The apples are good for you. Lots of fiber things. Alright, let's go. I really need to get some holy water. This is insane, the encounter rate. Alright, um... Oh, we got new enemies, dead fathers. These guys are evil dead priests. And they're evil, and they're dead, and they're priests. Whoa! I think they can do wind attacks, wind spells, and stuff. But yeah, if you remember correctly, there's a big desert to the west of Moonbrook. And we got another new enemy, Bombcrag. And as you can see, all my characters are on level 10 now. I can change them if I wanted to, but like I said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to hold off on that until I, uh... Oh, this guy's got a lot of HP. I'm gonna try to hold off on that until, uh... Until, uh... I'm on level... 20 or so, because this region's gonna get... tough. We got a wild ape. I'm gonna show him. Because why the hell not, right? We're kicking ass and taking names. Alright, so we found the very first beautiful thing. The the illusion is looking for. Will we find the second one in the next episode? Who knows? This has been Kinch1913. I'll see you later. Bye bye.